saved. Because the day I went to work was just about like the day they had been pouring down rain and I got stuck. And they sent a truck to pick us, pick me up. I went to work in October 43 and it was in early 44 before I got sick. My uh, entire time out there was online for it. And uh, we assembled, uh, they, in addition to 105s, we assembled 155 howitzers. Well, I was, what, 19 years old, and I didn't, I was living on a farm, and, and I just wanted some money. <laughs> Everybody wanted to work on the arsenal. But some people were scared. My first job, they fill in these things with the powder, and we had to wipe them off. They were glue and stuff on them. We wiped them off. And the next one, they went into the casing. They put them in cases. It was sent on to another building. And that was my first job. We worked all holidays. We didn't have a holiday off. And it was like if Abby had to come in for Christmas, then I would try to help her get off Christmas in vice versa. And there's people on either side of a table they throw those things up, uh, scare me to death because I knew they should be more careful, not know how to explode. I, I spray painted the shelves. That's all I, all I did. Uh, but, you know, I thought that, 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 that was my job. But then it was changed to grenades, you know, and different things. But the first one in four, third one, I think, was one. I was spray painting the shelves as they came down the assembly line. To just be frank with you, we were all scared most of the time anyway. Because we knew what we were working with and from, you know. We were making shells and, and all that kind of stuff. Grenades. You know, I just wasn't afraid of the job. The only thing I hate is I don't wash the gas. We were uh, inspecting fuses. And one of them went off in a fellow's hand and blew it off. And I thought, this is time for me to go back home. Right here, I got stayed with it. And that was the only explosion that I ever came close to. We, we were putting in four slow pots on a train one time. And we were writing their names on those in four slow pots. Yes, we did. I got letters from all over the world. Colonel Hudson, Major Hudson, had been to another uh, ordnance plant and had seen the women in uniform. And he came back and suggested, asked me what I thought, as clear as me, what we thought about. We thought it was a great idea because, um, you know, it just helped you so much money-wise. It wasn't very close because we were all working in the same thing. And we all knew what it was about. And at that time, most of our boyfriends and everything were over there. And that was bad. But I, I, I like it out there because I, 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 I fell in love. I just loved the people, you know, that I was working with. Well, now that was a big accomplishment to me, to meet all those people and to know them. And then have friendship with them, and some of us still do. And we had such a good time. We had a good time. I had a great group, even though they were all different. But everybody blended in. But we had a good time. We really did. Well, I had a hand in the war being over. 